Here we'll be covering Level 2 programming with Snap and the Finch robot. Much like Level 1, we will be controlling direction, colors, and sounds. But in Level 2, we'll be able to make a few changes to the parameters of those elements. After opening Level 2, you should see an example program in place. At the top of this example, you'll see a control block. In this case, the block will determine which key will activate the program. It is currently set so the spacebar activates your Finch program. Click your spacebar and you'll start the example. Just below that, a series of connected blocks will form your program. The four arrows work as your movement blocks, moving your bot forwards, left, right, and backwards for half a second. The number next to the arrow notes the speed at which the bot will move. Just type in a number ranging from 0 to 10. The LED block sets the color of the LED built into the beak. The red, green, and blue intensities are set individually from 0 to 10. Each element will add up to the final mixed color. The lightning or buzzer block will play a musical note ranging from A to G. You can also put in a number and it will play that as a frequency in Hertz. This block will play with a half second delay. You can test any block by simply clicking on it once. Try this. Click on the Go Forward block and see what happens. You can add to the existing program by placing any of the blocks you desire in the chain. Or start from scratch by deleting the blocks from the example program, either by selecting Delete or just clicking and dragging the block away. Let's create a program where the finch goes forward at a full speed of 10. Now turn the LED yellow by setting red and green at 10 and blue at 0. Then have the bot turn left at 5 and change the color to blue. And finally, let's add a G note at the end. Now press your spacebar to try the new program. And now you know how to program in Level 2. For more on SNAP programming, check out the other videos in our playlist.